What's up YouTube, Mike here from Techno GI, and today I wanted to do a review on a little product, and when I say little product I mean it, and it is a SSD drive. Now this is not just any SSD drive, this is a external portable SSD drive. Not that you put in your computer, but one you can carry around in your pocket and you just plug it into a USB 3.0, or in this case, a USB Type-C. Now this is the Samsung T3. As you can see, it fits in the palm of my hand. And I gotta say, so far, I'm loving this. And the reason I bought this is, you know, if anybody's following my channel, you know that I have a Microsoft Surface Book. I like the computer. However, Microsoft kinda screwed us when they put a the SSD drive that they put in my computer. The read speeds are pretty good, but the write speeds for the drive that they put in the 128 gigabyte model of the Surface Book is only around 100 megabytes a second which is terrible. You can actually get old HDD hard drives that go faster than that. So I was trying to find a way to speed up my video editing. So I went on Amazon and I found this little guy, like I said. And so far I'm loving it. It uh, advertises up to about 450 megabytes per second write speed. I've been getting probably around 300 to 350, which is still pretty good and it's still three times as fast as the drive that comes in my computer. So uh, let's take a closer look at this Taking now. Taking a closer look at this, this is the box that comes in. Uh, nothing fancy, it's a box. Uh, but this thing is designed to work with Microsoft or uh, Mac, and you can also hook it to a Samsung device. So not necessarily Samsung, but I'm saying an Android smartphone. But here's the actual device itself. Let's see if we can get her focused on here. But as you can see, it is a very small drive, um, but it's a solid piece of aluminum, very sturdy construction. I mean, I wouldn't want to try and drop this, but I feel fairly confident um, that if I did, it would be fine. Um, but like I said, nice design. It's got one port on it, one port only, and it's a USB Type-C. But um, it does exactly what it's supposed to, uh, no issues. I like it quite a bit. So now let's plug this thing in and I'll give you a performance demo. Alright, so I wanted to show you something uh, before I actually show you the performance. This is where I got it from. I got it on Amazon. And as you can see right now it's showing $117 for a 250 gigabyte model. Now when I bought mine it was $99, so it's actually went up in the last uh, three weeks. But of course on Amazon prices fluctuate. But you can get this thing starting at 250 gigabytes all the way up to 2 terabytes, which is insane, but the price is also insane for 2 terabytes, but um, so far the 250 gigabyte, I'm loving it, it's all I need, cause like I said, I just wanted to use it for uh, editing videos and just transferring files quickly from my computer, so totally worth it, I highly recommend it, I will put the link to this in the description below, so if you want to buy this from Amazon, I will show you the link, so now let's go ahead and uh, check out some performance. Alright, so I really won't know, um, hopefully this is in semi-focus, but is what I'm going to do now is I'm going to time it so you can see, but right now I'm into the drive, the Samsung T3, and I've got a approximately 22 gigabyte folder here, and it's got multiple files in it. It's all 4K video, so it's pretty heavy stuff. Now I'm going to take and I'm going to transfer it from the T3 to the desktop, and I'm going to time it, and I'm going to bring it from the desktop back to the T3 just to show you the speed difference. So drag this guy over here and three, two, one, let go. It's starting to transfer. And like I said, hopefully this is in focus. But right now it's about seven percent. Like I said, hopefully I get the focus right, but as you can see, she's going, um, and it's actually moving pretty good. Like I said, this is a large file, and uh, it's showing me about 2 minutes, 15 seconds remaining, but we'll see uh, 17 gigs left to transfer. But um, we're just letting it run here. 10% uh, left in just over 2 minutes, which is pretty darn good. Uh, I ran a test earlier, let's see, yeah, and it was actually 30 seconds faster than it was when I ran a test earlier, so 2 minutes 34 seconds for moving it from the drive to my desktop, so we'll reset this, 
And now is what we're going to do is we're going to move it back. So I'm going to take this and drag it back. And three, two, one. Alright, so there you have it. 1 minute and 21 seconds to transfer almost 23 gigabytes of movies uh, into this drive from the desktop, which is pretty freaking awesome if you ask me. So there it is, the Samsung T3. Totally worth it. I highly recommend it. Again, I will put the link in the description down below. As always, hopefully this video helped you out. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you're looking for easy ways to speed up your... Uh, laptop drive speed without replacing the internal drive, this is a great option for you. So as always, please subscribe. Thanks.